Central Valley Real Estate on www.centralvalleytalk.com. Welcome, you guys. My name is Zachary Browning, and I am here with JP Holman. JP, thank you so much for, uh, for joining us today. I'm learning so much from JP. Number one, he used to be a personal trainer just like me, so I'm going to have him on California Health and Fitness here pretty soon. Number two, Central Valley Health and Real Estate. He is a, an insurance salesman, so he sells insurance for Pacific Ag Insurance, and uh, it sounds like he's an extremely intelligent yet busy man. So, JP, I want to hear first off just about yourself. So, uh, I was born and raised here. Uh, then I met my wife, and she was down in San Diego. Beautiful. So similar thing. Uh, we moved down to San Diego, and then we were just up here visiting my mom. My wife actually fell in love with here, and then wow. uh, we moved up here. So wow. great place to raise a family. Uh, for me, it was moving home, but for her, she loves the spot. So she really loves being here. So we're back in the area and uh, love it. So we've been here for about two years, a little over two years, and it's great. You guys have kids? We have two girls. Awesome. Two girls. It's awesome. great. Awesome. Yeah. So they're close to the whole family. Right. Uh, where do you? Where do they go to school? They are right. They're too young for school. Right ah, now. Yeah, three okay. And one, so okay. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. So Pacific Ag Insurance. Now you are. Um, so are you the owner, the CEO? No, uh, no. I, what do you I, do for Pacific Ag? I'm an agent there, so I'm a commercial cool. agent. So com uh, Pacific Ag Insurance, in general, uh, is obviously an ag insurance firm. So we insure a lot of farms, dairies, those sort of things locally. So we have three branches in awesome. uh, Hanford, Corcoran, and then uh, Chowchilla for uh, the, the ag side of it. And then we also are one of the largest tribal gaming uh, insurers. Wow. So our founders and owners are both uh, uh, card carrier and tribe members. So we have lots of volume in business, which uh, gives a big advantage insurance wise for real estate. So when I get to real estate, why anybody would go for real estate insurance through me? So for real estate investors, let's say you have anything from your flipping to you own multiple apartment complexes, shopping centers, that sort of thing. We have direct appointments with uh, the carriers. So that means that I actually get to talk to the underwriter, the person who decides whether or not they're going to take the risk, and we can negotiate directly with them for the price. And then we can also create bidding wars, which is not a typical thing that uh, can be done by an insurance agent. Wow. So it's a huge competitive advantage, and it's something that really people don't know or understand. Insurance is kind of complicated, so people kind of miss the point a lot. <laughs> so you're getting every you're getting every input output, and what's available to you insurance wise, but through a person. And I think that's extremely important right. because you're not dealing with uh, a computer on the phone that can't understand you. You're not right. trying to find the right link on the computer. You're dealing one on one with someone who's an expert right. in exactly what you're trying to get. Exactly, and a lot of people think that they pay more for that, but in insurance you don't. The premium is the premium and the insurance company actually pays us. So the price that the customer pays is the exact same amount if you do it yourself versus if you have an expert do it. So there is no customer paying it. So let's say you own a chain of apartment complexes and you go and get ABC insurance and you just get it yourself. You don't really know what you're looking at. There's different things that are different coverages based on different companies and you don't know what to look for. So uh, there'll be different things in there, coverage A, B, C, D, whatever it is, and you don't know what that means. So really having an expert look at it is important. And then the other thing too is, uh, you know, not only a lot of people will look for lower premium without looking for necessarily the proper coverages for what they need. Mm. So, uh, you know, apartment complexes, they might have somebody who collects rent. So they need insurance for the money that's there when uh, they've collected the rents or they need uh, liability for um, cyber risk. We talked about, you know, yeah. uh, people uh, with uh, stealing uh, personal information. So getting the proper cyber risk. So it's like going out and buying a pair of 12 shoes when you wear size eight because they're on sale for half price, right? Yeah, exactly. Or going out and saying, okay, I wear size 12 shoes and uh, I'm a personal trainer and going and buying dress shoes because they're size 12 shoes. Man. Yeah, that's <laughs> right? a great analogy. I, yeah, exactly, exactly. So I think you're a very knowledgeable person for first-time insurance buyers, and all, as well as you know people that are looking to maybe re uh, re-sign a contract or even just look for a new insurance because they're paying for yeah. something they don't need. Yeah, mainly what I work with are a little bit more sophisticated investors. So it would be somebody who actually owns multiple properties, who. Uh, has a portfolio of properties that they already are on, they're managing them. So property managers that work well with property managers to enhance their book, real estate agents so that the real estate agent can go and have more resources to bring. Yeah, I, 
I'm, I'm happy we have you on today. This is an extremely, uh, extremely cool thing because what is you know growing in Fresno right now? Farmers markets uh, in California. Sure. There's been a 210 percent spike in farmers markets in the last year and a half. That's sure. crazy. That's crazy. Where does all that food come from? Someone's got to buy land to grow it, right? Right. A lot of people are looking at this entrepreneur uh, venture as or looking at their, their ticket to success is buying some land in the Central Valley and starting a, whether it be a juice company, an organic fruit company, or even just a stand at the farmer's market. I've already seen it done. I've, right. uh, I've had a lot of people come and talk to me about it. Now, you're the person to talk to about that, am I right? Is it different insurance when you're buying property to grow that and live or just for business? Well, ag insurance is different from uh, homeowners or real estate insurance. It's different. So there's actually commercial insurance, personal insurance, which is your home, auto, that sort of thing. And then there's uh, ag insurance. So we can do all of that stuff for you, all in one house, take care of all of it at once. And we have a lot of clients that do that. They'll, they'll cool. go and they'll show their farm and they'll also maybe own an apartment complex. And then they also will insure their personal autos and their personal farm house or their personal house that's off the farm. We do all of that, you know, uh, so it's really an awesome thing to see. Yeah, so you have all the, you have all the, the availability and you provide everything that, you know, big companies, big corporate companies that you see on international, your, your national TV channels, you have all of that, but like I said, in a person. Right, and an you, actual local yeah, person actual that you can call, person. go and meet with an actual office, or we come to you, it's an actual real relationship that you have with a person instead of just uh, a person on the phone. So it's an incredible experience and Extremely it doesn't cost you any more. It actually will probably end up saving money. Yeah, that's another question I wanted to ask. Now, when you when you insure multiple things, does that save you any money? If, say, Absolutely. I insure my, my crop for my green smoothie that I'm marketing and my house, does that save you some money? Yeah, the easiest way to go and understand it, there's multi-policy discounts, which you'll hear about on advertising all the time. But where it really gets into it, let's say uh, for a real estate investor, you have multiple properties. Typically what that goes in is they'll have multiple different policies for each one of those properties, which means they're going to have multiple dis deductibles. So each one, of, even if they have a small deductible, they're paying that deductible. So let's say you own and you're trying to buy a local area and you're staying in one neighborhood and you know there's a fire on the whole block and you get a loss on multiple properties, you're paying that deductible over and over where you can consolidate it, put it on one policy of one deductible that you would pay for the whole year that would cover every single property of one person to talk to. And then that gives you a premium discount too because you're able to go and say, I have multiple policies as well. So it's a really an awesome way to do it. It's just easier. It's just streamlines. Yeah. It makes it easy. Wow. <laughs> Mr. JP Holman, I really appreciate you coming on with your knowledge today. Uh, I appreciate you giving us some good advice. And I also appreciate you uh, sharing a little bit of you know, health advice with the thing. That's pretty cool that you're an ex-trainer like myself. Uh, it's, it's something that's extremely important into any aspects of life, whether you're actually selling a house as a realtor and you need some more energy, right. or whether you're selling insurance, uh, you need that little extra pep to overcome objectives and close right. that sale and uh, just live a lot longer. Now you guys go check JP's YouTube video out. Um, it's gonna be a great source of information if you're, you know, in the future you have plans for even just buying a house, a car, or opening a you know your own farm to make this place a, a healthier place to live. Uh, people like JP, we need a little bit more of in the Central Valley. You guys, we'll be right back with our cosmetic master. If you're a realtor, you can't sell a house if it doesn't look good. Mr. Ed Dunn is coming up next to tell us how to make that place look better. You guys, Central Valley Talk. We'll be right back.